What's up guys, it's your boy Weezy2k here, and with the official release of Bone Lab, we've been given a chance to play as custom avatars. Now the only issue is, I don't see anywhere where people are actually posting how to get it, so today I'm actually going to show you guys how to get custom avatars into your game on PC VR. Now for Quest 2, it's going to be a little bit different, so I'm going to make a separate video for that here soon, but let's get into it. Alright, so first thing you want to do is go into your search bar and start looking up mod.io. Now this is going to be the primary search engine, or the primary uh, mod thing that we've been using for the mods, and you guys can see we're going to be clicking Bone Lab here, but you obviously they have different games you can look around for and stuff like that. Now as you load into it guys, obviously you're going to see a bunch of different mods here for characters. Uh, obviously we have Ghostface and Venom and stuff like that. And as well as different levels and even NSFW mods. Now obviously I'm not going to be picking those because that doesn't play into what YouTube can do. So obviously I don't want to get banned. But however, we are going to be looking around to figure out what we want to pick. And we're going to be picking Bowsetta. Now when we pick Bowsetta, basically what we're going to go ahead and do is click on the live files. Click on the download button. And then we're going to save it to desktop, and then we're going to hit save. Now, one thing I do want to note is that some of these will say Android or Windows. Android's going to be for the Quest 2, and then Windows is going to be for PC. So make sure you guys hit the Windows version. Now, there's going to be two different downloads you can get sometimes, but usually it's going to be in one folder, and just make sure you guys select the right thing. Then once we're on our desktop screen, we're going to go ahead and open our run command, and then we're going to go ahead and type in the percent sign app data then percent sign again and click OK once we go ahead and do that it's just gonna load up a little page to help us locate our game file and where it's located at um, unless you guys have it I made a shortcut on mine because it's just easier to do so I can just go into it then you're going to go ahead and hit app data hit local low head into stress level zero bone lab and hit mods and as you guys can see here I have multiple mods installed and ready to go for the game as you guys can also see your duck season hover junkies there now we're going to open the file itself. We're going to go ahead and you know make this clean so we can actually make sure we see what we're working with. And then you guys can see here, we just go ahead and drag the file just like this. And then we're going to drop it in. And that's it. It's now officially in your game. Once it's fully in here, go ahead and load up Bone Lab and we'll go ahead from there. All right, now that we're loaded inside of Bone Lab, we can go ahead and take a walk on over to the Body Mall. Now, one key note I do want to say, guys, you do have to have all the avatars in order to actually go ahead and put the custom stuff on your thing. But yeah, so once we go ahead and load it up, we can go ahead and see that we have a bunch of custom mods in here, but we're looking for bows. So just like that, bows that we go ahead and click her, click confirm, and then we can walk on over to the mirror. It is us, and look, there we are. And it's just that simple, guys, to go ahead and load in, you know, these avatar mods. Now we can also load in different vault mods, like I have John Wick, I have Deadpool, um, I also have uh, Master Chief, as you guys are about to see. Um, and it's really cool to see that these characters inside the game, because a lot of these guys are the ones I wanted to play as. Even including the one itself that I'm going to show you guys in a second because I also have a different anime girl here. But my last one I'm pick is the one I wanted the most is going to be Rebecca from Cyberpunk. And I actually got her in the game. And it's fucking awesome, guys. So if you guys like this video, go ahead and click the like button down below. And hopefully I, I expect to see you guys have some fun inside the Bone Lab itself. And you guys have a great one. Peace.